how can you be from Abia where, Abia where state government is owing workers salaries and you want to protest in Lagos? Reno Mokri. As the August 1st proposed planned protest over economic hardship draws near, Reno Omokri has asked the Lagos state government to ensure they ship non-indigenous residing in the state back to their home states where they can express their grievances. In a post shared on Instagram, Reno asked how a person from Abia state where the state government allegedly owes workers salaries wants to process in Lagos where the state civil servants and pensioners are promptly paid their dues. He alleged that the wanton destruction witnessed during the October 20, October 20th, 2020 NSAS protest in Lagos states was carried out by non-indigents and that the state government should ensure this does not repeat itself. As he said on Instagram, I encourage the Lagos state government to support the planned protest by providing free transport for all Lagos residents wishing to protest. The buses will take them to their states of origin. How can it be from Abia, where the state government is owing workers several months' salaries and owes pensioners, and you want to protest in Lagos that pays its workers above minimum wage and does not owe salaries? Monday sit at home, chased you from your state to Lagos. Unknown gunmen made you relocate to Lagos. Low wages made you feel free to flee to Lagos. And now, after settling down in peaceful and prosperous Lagos, you want to do in echo what you do, could not do in your home state. Mba, except your state government has done what Lagos has not done for you, you should go there and protest. Well, what are your opinions on this? Make sure to leave them in the comments down below and don't forget to like and subscribe and make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel. And don't forget to share this video with your family and friends so that they know what is going on and they can give their own opinions on this. Now, let's see what other people have to say about this. The stupid thing is that they rigged a vagabond into power and when what they imported came to them, they began to ask us for protest. You lost your sense of reasoning after taking a lot of colors. This protest is not state protest, rather Nigeria's problem. So wherever you reside in Nigeria, you are free to join in the 10 days protest. No matter how you talk bad against this protest, nobody in the ruling government will take you seriously. Come home and make this kind of noise, then I will call you a man. Ethnic, policy, ethnic politics. If it is your tribesman, you won't see anything wrong exactly how NSARS was eroded. If people stop commenting on this man, who post him for no day post nonsense like this again, I swear. It will not, because in NSARS, one can see remnants, but for Oro, anything he swallowed, the remnants shall never be seen. In tradition, it must be held. Once we pray for a mockery, he will surely die within a few days and his tongue will be outside his mouth. This a mockery is not in the country. He is outside the country and busy saying rubbish. Come back to Nigeria and see if they will not crunch you. Is the protest a state affair? Don't mind those foolish Igbo Labour Party people. We have told them they should go to the various states and protest. Any protest bam like this, they should know their shops will burn down in the name of protest. You hate your hate for Ibos is dragging you close to your grave gradually. I won't be surprised if you develop heart attack any day because of Ibos. Keep shining their shoes for free. Reno Mokri, you are going beyond your bounds. Mind you that you are a product of a bad background. Since I know you, I never hear anything good come out of your mouth. 
This guy is absolutely going insane. Does his people even advise home? One day, he will also foolishly say that Nigerian citizens whose state government cannot give work doesn't deserve to get work in other states. Your desperation for recognition is making you lose your con little praises that you get from fellow clowns is driving you into the bush. Are you the Lagos State Governor's self-acclaimed PA or what? Stop disgracing yourself or dragging other people's job even though we know that you lack shame. Well, these people have all given their opinions on this. Make sure to leave your own opinions in the comments down below and don't forget to like and subscribe and make sure to turn on notifications so you can be notified when we upload daily content here on this channel and don't forget to share this video with your family and friends